A DFL state senator from Brooklyn Center says the legislative session was difficult for anyone with a moral compass. And for the third year, Senator Chris Eaton worked to hold pharmaceutical companies accountable for the opioid epidemic. But in the end, no new funds were allocated. It's very disappointing. I mean, like I've said to many people, the people of Minnesota lost. And the, and the special interests, uh, Big Pharma, uh, Medical Alley, uh, the Chamber, all who had a lobbyist at the Capitol in droves, uh, won. Other local projects that did pass include funding for converting Highway 252 in Brooklyn Center and Brooklyn Park to a freeway. MnDOT has announced about $130 million toward that $163 million project. And Senator Eaton is also pleased that Brooklyn Center will get some of the $10 million in funding to improve metro area regional parks. She expects the money will be used by Three Rivers Park District to improve trails in Brooklyn Center connected trails to the rest of the system so that'll be good that's uh, a lot of people use them I know it goes right through my neighborhood so a lot <laughs> they're well utilized and and I think that's positive Senator Eaton vows to continue her work on the opioid epidemic she says depending on how the November elections affect the makeup of the legislature she will either bring it back to the legislature next session or she'll talk to the Attorney General about a lawsuit against the big pharmaceutical companies